it's your boy V Games, and today I'm gonna to be doing a video on the simulation of Kevin Durant. If instead he joined the Golden State Warriors, he joined the Toronto Raptors. So all basketball fans know that Kevin Durant moved from OKC after spending roughly around nine years. I don't really know the exact years of his career in OKC. Um, after nine years, he um, left the um, Thunder to go to the Golden State Warriors. But in this case, I'm going to be doing what if he went to the Toronto Raptors? Um, so a lot of you guys may not know this, but from a couple of sources, I actually found out that Kem Durant's favorite team growing up was the Toronto Raptors and his favorite player was a Toronto Raptor icon in Vince Carter. And so today I'm going to be doing a simulation if on uh, what if Kevin Durant was on the Toronto Raptors. So as you can see here, here is Kevin Durant, um, 29 years old in this. Um, I'm not sure that's his proper age, but we'll take it. Um, this roster is pretty, pretty accurate to say the least. Um, what I had to do so there wasn't a 2016-2017 roster, so I had to do the 2015-2016 roster, or pardon me, 2015-2016 roster, and then simulate that, make the trades necessary that happened in the 2015-2016 season, do the draft, do the draft trades to make it as more accurate as possible, and then put in... Uh, put in the um, rosters and everything for this video and it also automated so I don't really control the team um, we can be looking into the rosters looking into the coaching game plan uh, let me do that real quickly um, there it is I kind of adjusted it right now but the computer took is taken over from this point so it's up to 2k to decide uh, the proper uh, lineups so we, here we have Kyle Lowry, DeMar DeRozan James Johnson, uh, former Raptor, he played, I think, two, two years on the Toronto Raptors. Uh, Jonas Valanciunas, Damari Carroll, Corey Joseph, Terrence Ross, Jakob Pertl, Pascal Siakam, Patrick Patterson, Norman Powell, a young Norman Powell, um, and Jared Sullinger. And as you can see here, here is Pascal Siakam, uh, round one, pick 27, 2021. It's actually in 2016. Um, uh, but Ronald, for some certain reason, you can't change the year, so it's 2021. Um, and yeah, so he's freshly drafted, 72 overall. Um, I also did some trades. I don't know where to check that. Uh, if someone can let me know in the comments, um, I can maybe show you the proof of you know my trades and stuff. Uh, hold on, let me try finding it. Where is it? See, these uh, settings are so bad. I'm sorry. I hate these settings. These settings are terrible. Like the setting system, the look of it. It looks like the 2K9 one. Um, I love 2K9. I played it a bit. Uh, I didn't play it when, you know, the game was, you know, alive and stuff. But when I played it, I really enjoyed the experience. But the settings were kind of trash. You know, I was playing 2K17 and the settings are so much easier. I don't know why 2K changes up stuff. Whenever they change up stuff, it's terrible. Um, so I can't really find that for you. I can't really check the history. I, 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 it was, I know I can find this in 2K17, but unfortunately I can't really show that to you guys right now. I don't want to waste any time with this video because I don't know if this video is going to be edited because I am talking with some people, uh, right now. Um, yeah, okay. I found it right now. Uh, So here are all the uh, trades that I made. So Markeith Morris, Chris Humphreys, because a lot of them are not actually on the, you know, the teams necessary for the season. So I traded Matt Barnes. I, I put Abdul Nader um, to the Celtics because he was actually drafted by the Celtics. But, you know, I was pretty too lazy, you know, exactly putting the uh, rosters or the drafting and stuff. So I kind of just traded for second round picks because second round picks aren't useful anyway. I put... Um, uh, this dude, a Joffrey, I remember this guy in 2K17. Um, now that I think of it, he's supposed to be on the Nuggets, because I just checked on 2K. Um, 2K. Uh, Luke Bambit, a lot of unknown players, you guys, a lot a lot of you probably don't know who this is, especially for, you know, brand new fans that, you know, got into basketball. So uh, I did the Spencer Dinwiddie trade, I signed, it, I signed Christian Wood, and I did that stuff, so there's my proof. 
Um, anyway, uh, without further ado, let's get started. I'm going to be simulating to February 4th and see what happens. I'm pretty scared to simulate, to be honest, because this is my first time, you know, doing these simulation videos. I have a lot of uh, simulation videos in mind. Um, also, we don't, we can do stuff that is not in 2K. I know this is my first time uploading in, you know, a couple of years, two years to be exact. I'm currently recording at 1140, so I can have a bit more quiet. Um, so yeah, uh, let me simulate up to February 18th. Oh, and the Raptors are off to a good spot. Um, this is expected because this team is a very stacked team. Kyle Lowry, DeRozan, all those players. Uh, there's also a couple losses, but 17-2 is a pretty goddamn good record. If I were to say so myself, 21-5. I turned injuries off. I hope I did. Um, so this simulation will be accurate. And it is, and um, when you will see in the offseason... Uh, uh, the rookies are up to uh, status. Um, for example, there's Deer and Fox there, the other stuff like that. Um, let's see how our team is doing so far. Clear stats. Cameron Durant leading the way with 31 points, shooting really, really well. This is a absolutely amazing performance by Cameron Durant. I wouldn't be surprised if he's not winning MVP votes. This is a pretty insane stat. Uh, to say the least, a steal per game, a block per game. That is pretty good for KD. Um, a lot of people say his defense is bad, but I feel like he's really improving on his defense. Kyle Lowry averaging steal a game. Uh, same with uh, James Johnson, who's an absolute clamp god uh, from the last time I saw him play. Uh, I think he still is a clamp god today. He's on the Pelicans, from my understanding. Jakob Pertl not getting any minutes. I literally just put minutes on him, but they don't want to play him. Uh, Siakam's not getting any minutes. I need to fix this, because this is getting outrageous. Uh, where's Patterson? Oh, they're going to keep on playing Siakam. I mean, not playing Siakam. Just, it really gets annoying, because um, we need these young guys to you know, grow. Patrick Patterson is a waste of space. He's a 76. He's doing really well, um, but we don't really need him. Uh, Jakob Pertl's not going to get any minutes, unfortunately. Um, unless I take... Terrence Ross, Terrence Ross is minutes away. Uh, sorry, my bad. I had a slight burp. Um, uh, okay, so I'm currently controlling the entire team because, um, you know, it's pretty uh, hard to, you know, adjust these trades and do all these trades uh, with the CPU by itself. Um, and as you can see, like on the bottom there, the yesterday results, you can see players, Zach Levine. So you can already tell that my uh, rosters are pretty accurate. And I'll put my uh, the links in the description to where I got this information from to make these rosters. It took me about six days, I think two hours each day um, exactly to put these rosters up together. So yeah, it did take a long, long, long time because I wasn't able to access any um, 2016, 2017 uh, rosters, so I had to do from 2015, and I, I literally said that from the beginning, uh, what I had to do, so this was a long, long ass video, um, to, uh, to, to prep, um, a lot of overalls are going up, I did not put progressive fatigue, so people are going to go as high as, you know, they could be, um, we're going to be looking at the standings right now, and, uh, for this video, we'll be only doing, um, one uh, season, so one season each video, video, and my plan is to do three seasons of Kevin Durant on the Toronto Raptors. Um, I really hope they do eventually sign Kevin Durant um, when his contract does expire. Um, when his contract does expire, I'll make sure in the contract, when um, it has to be his contract, I'll put it to you know the highest it could be. Uh, salary cap is on at the moment to make it a bit more realistic. Uh, where is it? Team stats? Oh, oh, the Cavs are doing good. And the Timberwolves are doing really good. Um, uh, I, I follow the Timberwolves because of Cat. You know, he's my favorite center. A lot of people don't know this, but he is, in fact, my favorite center. Um, the Timberwolves are doing very, very good. I'm not expecting him to do this good. Uh, there is the old Kevin Garnett, 73 overall. Uh, Tory Craig was not on this team, from what I, um, know. Uh, Markel Brown, a lot of these players that have played on this team. 
in this season. Um, I'll put my proof in the description. Uh, Corey Brewer uh, is here. Uh, this is not an accurate um, Corey Brewer, from my understanding. Uh, he was a made-up player from the person that I got. He made this player, I think. Actually, no, this is a Corey Brewer from 2K. But there's Ty Lawson, I think, that's on this lineup. Ty Lawson? Uh, I don't think so. He's here at the mo uh, here. Uh, if I can go to the Nuggets. Oh, the Nuggets are doing pretty decent. Um, I'm pretty bad at navigating this because 2K made it so difficult to navigate. My apologies. Um, Carlos Boozer was not on this team, but I think he was an active player to sign. He was playing in Europe, from my understanding. Um, so, yeah. Uh, where is Ty Lawson? Uh, I swear Ty Lawson was on the Nuggets in this. Uh, there's Mike Miller. Uh, man, I can't find any autumn those made up players right now uh, there's a young Damian Jones uh, McGetty who's this ah, whatever um, I can't really show you that right now um, I'm gonna be simulating a bit more to be in fact I'm trying to make this less boring as possible because simulating might be pretty you know uh, boring at first uh, I don't know if this video is getting edited so uh, yes we want to stop uh, contract extension so let's see if people want to re-sign, Patrick Patterson wants to re-sign, Terrence Ross wants to re-sign, that's pretty good. Uh, J uh, James Johnson doesn't. Uh, Sullinger and Kabokolo, <laughs> man. Raptors fans, I bet a lot of Raptors fans know this guy, Bruno Kabokolo. Uh, he did play for the Raptors a bit. He was the worst player in the Raptors, sadly. Um, man, I, I kind of wish they don't sign James Johnson so they can give um, Siakam a chance. Um, and if you, can, um, if you can hear the Discord uh, notifications in the background, which you probably can't, um, that is, I'm currently on a call with my, um, you know, cousins and stuff. So, yeah, uh, uh, I kind of deafened myself so they can't hear me. Um, I'm making a video right now. Um, I'll probably tell them after I just deafened myself. They have no clue. Um, anyway, uh, that's it. I, I'm trying to try to find the league standings. NBA standings. There you go. Uh, Raptors, we're currently leading the way in... Why am I saying we? Uh, it's actually... Uh, the Raptors, uh, it's not we. I hated how uh, basketball players actually say... Or basketball fans say we, as in like, the, they think we, like they're part of the team. Like, oh, like a Hornets fan says, oh, we're a very good team. Um, the Hornets are a organization. You're not part of that organization. So you don't say we. Um... There's Kevin Durant there. Uh, the West, the Timberwolves are leading the way. Holy crap. This is unexpected whatsoever. I think Cat is doing really good this season. Um, he's not doing that. He's not even doing that good. I think his best season was 1920. Uh, 26 points. Uh, yeah, that's his best. His rookie season 18, of course. He's a rookie. Um, this team doesn't even look that good. Pekovic, yeah, see, there's Pekovic. He's not in the game, so someone had to make a Pekovic. This is a, a pretty goddamn pretty good uh, uh, Pekovic here. You can see the tats that Pekovic had um, there by Litsa, KG. This is not even that good of a team. I don't know how they're doing this good. Uh, let's see, Zach Levine stats, 24 points. Pretty good. Um, for Zach Levine. It's not too surprising. Wiggins is having a breakthrough season already. Um, not really breakthrough, but this is the best season on the Timberwolves, I think. No, this was his best, 16-17. So this season, he was supposed to be going off. And he, he is, in fact, going off. Uh, yeah, it seems like Wiggins' number is 39. Oh, that's pretty good, 3 points percentage. That is, in fact, his best in his career. Uh, that is pretty good. Uh, the Spurs, this is a pretty... Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, I forgot to retire Kobe. Ah, uh, he was supposed... You retired the season. Oh my god, he's playing on the Spurs. Yo, imagine if the old Kobe played on the Spurs. That would be pretty insane. Oh my god. He didn't retire the season. He didn't play the season. Um, I'm kind of happy the Lakers didn't pick him up again. Um, I guess the Spurs got carried by Kobe. Um, I'll make sure he's retired by next season. Um, 
Dirk already retired, and this is supposed to be his last season. They got Kendrick Perkins here as a filler. Uh, Jonathan Simmons, David Lee, he's on the team. Um, as you can see, this is a pretty um, uh, similar roster. But I can't believe they actually signed Kobe. Uh, I can't see his um, contract. Oh, yeah, he's only got a one-year. Dude, three million. I don't, know who he, I don't know how the contracts work exactly in 2K. I'm pretty sure this is a one-year deal from my understanding. So I'm really happy for that. Um, yeah, you, you can see he's 38 years old, a pretty old Kobe Bryant. He was a pretty good Kobe Bryant. Um, he dropped 60 in his last game. Um, people are saying that he did drop 60 because, you know, his team was feeding him the ball. But it's still pretty insane to do that at an age 38. Oh, and you could see Sabonis. Um, it doesn't show uh, that he was drafted from, from the Magic, but in fact, he actually was drafted by the Magic. Um, uh, if you could check the link down below, you could see that he was actually drafted by the Magic. My apologies for the noise in the background. Um, this contract isn't too accurate to what he had exactly. I don't know what he had exactly, um, but he is on the uh, Thunder. He's doing very well. Uh, great progression. Um, his stats are pretty well. The, the Thunder are doing pretty well despite uh, losing Kevin Durant. Uh, you can see Oladipo, 86 overall. Man, he was a stud before you know injuries came into play. Um, it's so disrespectful how play, uh, people are treating him um, now. He was one of my favorite players on the Thunder team. Cameron Payne, a 76 overall. He's going off in the playoffs as I speak. So I'm really proud of his um, work uh, in the playoffs for the Suns. Yeah, this team is pretty good. Yeah, this team deserves to be this high, but the Spurs actually got stealing Kobe <laughs> on his last legs. Man, I'm pretty insane. He's too loyal to leave, but um, it's 2K anyway, and, you know, Ronnie doesn't really care, but, you know, how players act in this game. You know, Kevin Durant, I remember in 2K17, signed with the Suns, apparently, with a young Devin Booker. Um, they actually got bounced out the first round in that simulation, so that's pretty insane, <laughs> pretty funny. Um, it's a young Clint Capella. This, uh, this is a pretty surprising one. This Rockets team isn't, you know, the greatest of Rockets teams, um, to say so, uh, for the most part. They have Bargnani, who they just waved, I think, um, if you guys catch that in the video. Uh, that's pretty weird. Um, okay, so this is first, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth. Oh, and the Clippers currently are struggling to get a playoff spot. This is a decent Clippers team, by to say the least. Um, they have Blake Griffin, who's really good before his knee injuries. Um, he's going, he still played really good for the Nets this season. Uh, it's pretty funny. Uh, Austin Rivers, um, Chris Paul, CJ... This, I don't know if this guy actually started for the Clippers. Yeah, my apologies for the rosters. I try my best. Uh, this, I try my best. Scott Wheeler, yeah, there's a lot of nobodies on this team. Spates, Wesley Johnson. Oh, I, I need to show you Wesley Johnson's contract. This guy is so bad. And um, I'm not even like, look at this. Look how much he's getting paid. Six million. And he's a 71 overall and he's 30 years old. I don't know why the Clippers signed this, man. What are you doing, Steve Ballmer? I think Steve Ballmer is in charge of the, the Clippers organization. I don't know if he makes the moves. I don't know who the GM is. I'm pretty sure he is the GM. You know, I'm not into the, the GM stuff and in the NBA. And yeah. Um, so... The Clippers are just barely hanging on. That's a pretty good team. Uh, some surprising teams. Lakers are pretty garbage. Let's see this Grizzlies team. Oh yeah, Zach Randolph in my simulation. He's an old. Like, let me check his age. He's 36 years old, and he 18 years pro. He's currently sad. He's heated. I mean, uh, he was on the. Let me check. Uh, his award history. So as you can see here, 2021, that is the 2015-2016 season that I simulated. He made second team All-NBA at 36 years old. That's insane. And he also made the All-Star game at age 38. He wasn't this good in 2015-2016. I swear he wasn't. Uh, this Mavis team, uh, this, this team could have had Dirk, but Dirk unfortunately retired. I don't know how to you know, switch that out. This is a Bogut. I think Bogut is not in the game. Or they couldn't get a Bogut, you know, an accurate Bogut. So they just made up a Bogut. This kind of looks like Bogut, I guess. You know, they have him from Australia. Um, he was drafted, I think, number one overall. And the funny thing is, he was actually almost drafted. I mean, not drafted, traded for Curry. That's how, you know, pretty good he was on that Bucks team that he was drafted by. 
um, which is pretty insane. Curry did have injuries, so his value was pretty low. But yeah, that's pretty insane to say the least. Uh, let's go to the, the east. It's this first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth. Uh, sixth, uh, this is the last seeded team. Jeremy Grant, a 75 overall, progressing really well because I think the Sixers are playing him a lot. The, uh, by the way, this is the computer completely taking over. Um, as you can see in the video, clear evidence that I didn't go back. Even if this video is edited, edited, I did not touch these at all. So these are all 2K simulations. And yeah, um, Dario Saric, Robert Covington, Korkmaz, Luol Cabarro, TJ McConnell. Oh, this is a pretty promising team. Rashawn Holmes, they kind of sold for, you know, letting go of Rashawn Holmes. He would have been a big help there instead of Dwight Howard. Even if they had Dwight Howard, they had have three centers. Um, that could really help and be, you know, not get tired and overplay him. <laughs> I think that was the issue of them not making it far. Oh, man, those <laughs> Discord notifications are scaring the living hell out of me. On this team, this Bulls team, I actually kind of like this Bulls team. You know, a old D. Wade, he was pretty decent on the Bulls. Nothing too special. He lost his touch when it comes to dunking. Let me check his driving dunk tendencies, or not his tendencies, his driving dunk and stuff. Yeah, 59. He was pretty old. So, yeah, as you can see, his driving layup is pretty good. He was a pretty good, you know, layup person for, you know, his age. He, he didn't dunk too much. Um, you see mid-range. Yeah, this is a pretty accurate D-Wade. So, thank you to whoever made this, um, uh, this, whatchamacallit, the rosters, um, I can't really speak right now. It's 11 o'clock or 12 o'clock right now. Oh, man, I'm pretty tired. But I wanted to put out a video because I haven't put a video out in so long. And I do this for fun in the anyway. I don't do this for money. You know, I only have like 20 subscribers. Probably five people that I know are watching this video. Um, if you guys are watching this video, please share it with your friends, people to who you know like to watch basketball content. And whatever game that you want me to see, like want me to play, or um, uh, like play, I, I currently am playing Red Dead Redemption 2. It's an old game, but it's a really, really good game. I'm really enjoying it so far. Um, also, I'm playing Hitman 2. If you want me to see play, play any missions, do any challenges, such as um, a, uh, a video that I watched from a YouTuber. Um, he did a video killing everyone in the map. That's a pretty funny video. Um, and yeah, pretty, uh, uh, pretty cool. I'm um, getting off track here. Uh, the Sixers are the eight seed. Let me check. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, the Sixers are the eight seed. The Bucks team with a Giannis. Is Giannis here? Yeah, 89 overall Giannis. Michael Beasley, who got signed a one-year deal here. Uh, if you guys don't know, I think he's actually playing for the Summer League. He's playing with the uh, Blazers, so congratulations to him. I hope he makes a massive comeback in the NBA. Um... He was a solid player, despite, you know, having those weed problems and everything like that. You know, I, he's still a solid player, so I, I, I take props for him for that. Um, the Sixers are tied with them. I mean, not the Sixers, the Pistons. Uh, this team was pretty stinky, to say the least. Andre Drummond, this was his prime. You know, when he was a free agent and the Lakers picked him up, I was expecting him to, you know, play like this, this Andre Drummond. I miss this Andre Drummond, you know, 85 overall. He still couldn't shoot. But, you know, he was such a dog in the paint and in the board section and everything like that. It's, he's such a dog. And that's what I really like about, you know, this Drummond. And I wish he could do this on the this team. Oh, and this Nets team was so bad. It was one of the worst teams in 2K17. So I'm not surprised about this. Look at that. Anthony Bennett, Glenn Davis. He was not on the team, but he was a filler. Greg Oden, Karis LeVert. I hope he got playing time. He's one of my favorite players currently right now. Um, he didn't get any playing time. This is really pissing me off. I hate how these players are not getting minutes. They're rookies. They deserve to get minutes. But 2K aren't playing them, uh, which is really, really making me mad. <laughs> um, he's on a multi-year deal. I hope he is. Uh, let me check. Yeah, he is. So he'll probably get playing time next season. Uh, the Celtics here with Jalen Brown, who just got drafted, Terry Rozier. This ain't a bad team. I'm pretty surprised they're the worst team. Um, there are no injuries, so this is a straight-up simulation. I'm pretty surprised about that. Uh, right now, let me go back to the Raptors. So we can see how the Raptors are doing. 
uh, Kevin Durant is going off, as you we saw last time. Um, I would be surprised if he does win a championship. And I know this video is pretty long. My apologies. Um, I'm. I hope I'm not rambling too much. Uh, please let me know in the comments. You know, I can. You know, maybe just do straight simulation. If you guys just want to see simulation, and stop the chattering that I'm doing right now. Uh, leave it down in the comments. Um, whatever you guys want to see. Honestly, I'm doing this for fun. Um, you know, quarantine. Well, this is not quarantine really. You know, quarantine really died down a little bit. Uh, let me check the trans and transaction reports. Oh, I can't speak. Transaction reports. Uh, hold on. Where is it? Uh, man, I really hope this is recording right now. Uh, it's my first time actually recording a video on the PS5. I'm currently playing on the PS5, as you can see me playing next gen. Um, so yeah, I got the PS5 in March. I really enjoy the PS5 experience in general. Uh, it's a really good console. I, I'm not using any uh, what you call it, uh, the uh, capture cards or whatever they're called. I'm not using that at all. Um, let me check this. Standings? Where is it? Oh man, this is so annoying. Look at these settings. <laughs> what is this shit? <laughs> I, look how complicated this is. 2K made it simple layout, and then now they're doing this bullshit. <laughs> I don't know where it is. I forgot where it was. I'm pretty. I don't know if I'm slow or not, but man, I can't find it, man. Oh my god. I'm so slow. Where is it? Oh, oh anyway, I, I look at your rookie report right now. Ben Simmons, probably going to win rookie of the year from what it looks like. Ingram healed, Sabonis, Labrissi, Labrissier. Man, this guy was a bust and he's playing really good for them. Man, I wish he's getting minutes on like some players like Karis LeVert and stuff. Kind of sucks, man. Like. Man, that really sucks. I, I don't want to change anything because I want to make it, you know, as accurate as possible. I don't want to touch anything. I want to let 2K do the work. I feel like that's a... Oh, wait. It says Karis LeVert. It's getting minutes. I swear to you, it said zero minutes from what I saw. I'm so happy he's getting minutes now. Brogdon. Um, look, look at this. Round two, pick six. And he's doing this good. What the hell? He was an absolute stud uh, coming into the league. Wheeler? I don't know who Wheeler is. Man, the, the Clippers kind of sold in the, whatchamacallit, the uh, the thing. They missed out on DeJounte. Murray was selected 30th. They had the 26th, 27th pick. And the Clippers did really bad in that draft. Can't lie. Um, can check the transaction report. I'm pretty new to this stuff, so please don't, you know, bully me in the comments. Pretty new to the transaction. I can't find it. What the hell? Um, anyway, I'm just going to simulate to the end. Um, next video, I'll probably show the transactions of the previous years and stuff. Um, but I want to keep this a fast simulation. The Raptors are up. This is probably one of their best seasons as a franchise. Pretty, pretty good record. I was talking with my cousins about how good the Raptors do. Uh, my cousin told me that they would win three championships with Kevin Durant on this team if he stayed for, you know, a long term. And I kind of agree with that. LeBron James. Oh, wow. What a stat line from LeBron. Is he in 99? Yes, he is. What a stat line. This is a this is his best season. Holy crap. 11 rebounds, 33 points per game, 10 assists. One steal per game, one block per game. Jesus Christ, shooting pretty well from three. Holy. Let me check his stats. Uh, our attributes. Oh my God, 83 three-point shot. Holy. This LeBron, holy crap. Ben Simmons winning um, rookie of the year as expected. Uh, this guy was like a rookie, rookie for so many years, I think, from my understanding. Uh, he won rookie of the year when he was like, third year but this is a full non-injury roster so this is a straight up simulation i wish 2k was a bit more accurate with the situ um, simulations like having you know what players would actually do what would kevin durant actually do he wouldn't actually you know sign with the suns um maybe assign for a team that how would he have like one good player maybe like the mavs or something like that maybe something like that uh Ben Simmons having a decent season on the least, uh, eight rebounds, five assists. I think he's playing point guard for the uh, Sixers. 
Uh, Jabari Parker winning sixth man of the year. Wow, that's pretty shocking. Jabari Parker, you know, he was a pretty, pretty busty type player right now. He's currently on the Celtics, from my understanding. Um, he is getting a little better, but, you know, this is what we expected from Jabari Parker on that team with Giannis there. Um, man, 2K so bugged out. It's a curse of it at zero minutes. I can't, I'm so bamboozled. Man, that scared me, that uh, Discord thing. Uh, Anthony Davis winning uh, uh, Defensive Player of the Year. Um, I don't believe AD is that good of a defender, in my opinion. This is a really good season for AD. Um, pretty good three-point uh, three percentage. Really good points per game, rebounds per game. Uh, two blocks per game. Holy shit. That's his most in his career. For sure. I don't even have to check. Oh, damn. He actually averages a lot of blocks. I didn't know this. Wow. He is a shot blocker. Is this normal for Bix to have two blocks per game? I swear this is normal. I mean, they are big men. They're like the only people who get blocks in the NBA. So I think this is pretty good. I think this is the most he averaged. Oh, nope. 14, 15, um, 2.9. Uh, that's pretty cool. Zach Levine improving from uh, last season, 2015, 2016. Uh, a massive upgrade. In that category, 24 points, jump from 12 to 20. How did he average 12? I'm confused. That doesn't make sense. He went up a lot in overall. I think that's that's what had to do with it. Dwayne Casey uh, on the Raptors. Uh, I forgot. I think when he won Coach of the Year, he was fired. I was kind of confused why they actually fired him. when. I mean, they weren't making it far anyway in the playoffs with him. He was just a great uh, regular season coach. He's currently coaching the Pistons, and he's really um, developing players really well. He was the guy on that Pistons uh, team when they had Christian Wood. He said that it was pretty sad to let him go. So he knew he was going to be a really good player and he really showed on Houston. So any Houston fans watching, um, uh, Houston fans, I absolutely hate a lot of them. I think the person editing this video right now, I think is my cousin. Um, I don't know if he is editing, editing the video, but he is a Houston fan. He made me hate the Houston Rockets. <laughs> I'm sorry, but he's a really cocky Houston fan. I know a lot of cocky Houston fans, um, and they hate Christian Wood. They want to trade him for some different reason. But I feel like even though he's like 26 or something, he should stay in the Houston Rockets. Leave your opinions down in the comments to whatever I'm saying. If you guys don't disagree, agree. Uh, this is a you know open channel. I don't care if you guys discriminate me, honestly, to be honest. Um, you guys should be totally brutal in the comments. Um, so yeah, feel free to leave your comments on whatever I say. Um, if I'm speeding up and everything, I want to keep this as fast as possible. It's 32 minutes as, um, from what I see right now. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see the timer on the top. Um, PS5 has a really good um, uh, function. You know, you don't need a capture card anymore. You can just upload straight from this. Um, my, my mic quality is pretty bad because I'm currently using a $30 headset. I had like a $60 headset, um, a Logitech headset. Uh, that's a pretty popular brand. Um, yeah, that was a pretty, pretty... Uh, good purchase that I made. It was a bundle and everything. Uh, the mic doesn't work, but I can hear audio and everything. Um, so yeah, uh, you here have James Harden first team. Let's see his points. Wow, I'm surprised he didn't win uh, MVP. Jesus Christ, these stats. James Harden always goes off on this Rockets team, man. He did so much for Houston. Um, I don't know. Houston fans should completely respect him, even if he left uh, the Nets. Um, I hate. I used to hate Harden a lot. Uh, I miss his OKC days as an OKC fan. Uh, I loved him on the Thunder. Uh, I only got to see him for one season because I was only a fan for one year of the Thunder. And I saw that Thunder team who eventually lost the Heat. And, you know, the Heat won and LeBron and stuff. Yeah, so um, LeBron James, of course, first team. Anthony Davis, defensive player of the year, first team. Drummond making first team. Wow, man, this Drummond really fell off. Man, look at this. Look at 1920 uh, stat line there. Man, he really fell off, man. He was such a good player. He shot threes for some apparent reason. 25%. What is this? He's shooting threes now? Okay. He shot pretty well. This is his best in his career. Wow, I, I'm, not, I've, I'm pretty surprised. He's shooting threes. Kemba Walker uh, currently on the Thunder right now. I hope his career, you know, really shows up. And as a Thunder fan, I feel like they should keep him just for the season. 
Um, I know they could trade him for assets and some stuff like that, but I feel like Kemba still has stuff left in the tank. Uh, you know, let him t- at least increase his trade value when, uh, before they trade him. Uh, Nikola Jokic, I'm so tired right now. Oh, man, I'm so tired from speaking. My apologies, but I want to put a video out just for you guys. Uh, Vucevic, his best season, I think. Yep, most points he averaged just by one. Um, pretty decent three-point percentage. He's a stretch big in real life, yeah. Um, pretty pr- pretty good player. He's on the Bulls right now. Um, I feel like Levine and Vucevic is still going to be a crazy, crazy good duo. It's an underrated duo in my opinion. Uh, blocks per game, stuff like that, pretty well. Damian Lillard, of course, Kyrie Irving, DeMarcus Cousins. Who remembers Prime Boogie? Oh my goodness. Prime Boogie was something else. Um, not his best points per game. New Orleans, Sacramento. I didn't know he was this good. Was he traded? Cousins? I thought he was a free agent signing by the Pelicans. Wow, I'm pretty surprised. Then he started ring chasing and stuff like that. As you can see, Warriors. This is his currently his Warriors player, but the person who made this roster um, upgraded his overall, well-deserved overall. He was such a dog here. Look at his three-point percentage. Probably one of the best big men in this game uh, or in this league right now. He's a stretch big, a very good defender. Man, this guy was such a good player before his injuries came into play. And he was one of those players who are currently trying to bounce back from an Achilles injury. And people forget, you know, Kevin Durant's doing so well despite him not carrying that Nets team. Uh, you know, you have him having a super team, you know, that's an injured super team. He tried his best. He dropped 40 points. Uh, everyone saw this. I'm a KD fan. I'm trying. I'm want to try. I'm trying to step up for KD. You know, he deserves the respect. Um, he necessary because he's such a good player. He's such a great player. Um, even though, you know, we call him a snake because he left OKC after nine years. I don't know if that's really snake worthy. He spent nine years on, on one team. And I know he went to the team who, you know, eventually he lost to. But, you know, that turned out to be one of the best teams of all time, best shooting teams of all time. And if you guys disagree with me, put it down in the comments down below. Um, D. Wade made a defensive team. I don't know he was a defender like that. Pretty surprising to me. I'm just going to check his defensive st- uh, stats. Ball handle, pretty nice. Wow. Yeah, this is not bad D. Wade whatsoever. Uh, steal, block. I mean, he has the stuff for a guard. You know, he's a pretty decent steal. Perimeter defense, 95. Maybe that's why he won it. Interior defense, uh, higher than average. As you can see there, the POS average. That is the precision average uh, for his precision as a shooting guard. Chris Paul. Man, he, he, he is not that a defender like that. Okay, 2K, I don't know what to say, but let's check his defense. Okay, it's pretty good perimeter defense. Interior defense, just above average. I guess he say he's a pretty decent defender. Uh, just above, above average defensive rebound. Um, Drummond, of course, Giannis. Oh, Giannis. Um, this is supposed to be a new... Oh my god, Giannis is a free agent. Holy crap. This is going to be a crazy next episode. Um, Giannis is a free agent. Oh my god, I'm so tired and thirsty. Uh, I'll quickly do the simulation for you guys. Um, Chris Paul on a massive contract. I'm pretty sure he didn't have that contract. I'm pretty surprised he's there in the defense, as I said earlier. Uh, pretty surprising to me. Uh, Victor Oladipo and the Thunder winning defensive second team. He's a pretty good defender uh, from what I saw in OKC. Pretty surprised he actually made a defensive second team. Um, Right, it's like people. Oh, yeah. Never mind. His defense is pretty well. Um, pretty decent rebounding, lateral quickness, help defense IQ. Um, I feel like uh, the help defense IQ. This stat alone is the most useless. One of the most useless stat lines, I think, in my opinion. Um, they, they don't even like the, the AI. Always plays the same. Does a stupid, stupid thing, all the time. Yeah. Rookie Ben Simmons. Uh, I'm not going to say any more. Um, pretty expected from the least. Chris Dunn, Sabonis, Brogdon. Ski Brissier's really stepped it up. Man, this guy was a bust. I swear. I- I'm not even joking to you. He was a bust. But he's really stepping it up now. I think because he's getting the minutes necessary. 28th um, pick in the draft. He's a 
he's doing pretty well. And Ski Labrusse was a good player, you know, coming into the draft. I remember seeing some of his footage and stuff. I really want to know how he played when I was younger. Um, so when I saw him, I thought he was going to be a decent player. He turned out to be a bust. But hey, he's playing really good right now, and the Kings are really giving a lot of, you know, playing time. So as you can see here, Timberwolves first seed. This is the most surprising thing in this video. Thunder second seed, Spurs third seed, pretty expected from there. Houston fifth seed, sixth. The Jazz team. Um, let me check this Jazz team really here. Gordon Hayward, uh, Rudy Gobert, who started to get good. Joe Johnson, the dribble god himself. Uh, Boris Diaw. Yeah, this is a pretty good, decent team. Um, I don't know what teams missed out. Uh, I want to see who teams I missed out. Raptors made it. The Cavs made it. Pacers made it. Wizards made it. Wow, that's pretty surprising. Auto Porter. This is a very, very mediocre team. Um, I think because it do went, it had to do with um, overalls. OJ Mayo, Mayo is a... I hope he's not getting any minutes. Is he getting minutes? Oh, he's only get, averaging two points. He's not doing that much. In fact, he was. I think he was actually banned from the NBA. I think it was a substance abuse or something from my understanding. He didn't play this season, so I put him on the free agency. So whoever they picked up, they picked up him. Malcolm Miller, I'm pretty sure he wasn't in the league. back. Th Actually, no, he was in the league. He was on the Raptors. I forgot to put him there. Uh, my apologies. Magic, pretty surprising. Tobias Harris um, on the Magic. Well, he started to get better on the Magic, I think. This is when Tobias Harris started to get well-known. 82 overall. Alfred Payne, this bust. Oh, my God. He's doing pretty good on the assist side of things. So he's not really a bust after all. Um, he's really improving as a player, which is pretty surprising. Uh, Jordy Meeks, Aaron Gordon. I don't know why these notifications are going on. Um, I'm getting pretty scared of them. It's pretty scaring me. I don't know why. Um, Charlotte Hornets made it with Kemba. This is a bad team. How did this team make it this far? I mean, they had Christian. Okay, never mind. Their depth is pretty well. Then, from the start of the season, these guys' overalls were pretty low to start off with. But I think over time, their overalls got higher. Like, Bellinelli was a 72. I swear to you. He was a 72 overall. Um, he's not doing that good this season, Bellinelli. I know this guy was a pretty good player in his career. A pretty good bench player. So, him having a high overall is going to really help them out. This hit Heat team was pretty me mediocre. Chris, uh, this is when Chris Bosh, I think, retired right after the season. Um, this is, I think, this, this looks like prime Chris, I mean, Chris Bosh, I can't speak. Chris Bosh, um, pretty surprising to me. Chicago Bulls, I think this video might be ending up to be an hour, to be honest. Um, the Hawks missed out. Dennis Schroeder, Paul Millsap. This is a pretty decent team, in my opinion. I thought they might make the 8th seed, but unfortunately they didn't. Um, the, this team, pretty expected. Uh, Knicks right here. Oh my goodness. Wow, this is unfortunate. I mean, they didn't make the playoffs this season, I'm pretty sure. Brad Wanamaker, my goodness. Abraham Stewart. That's a real player, I think. Abraham Stewart. Um, I checked. Um, if you check in the rosters in the link, that link that I put in the description, you can see that he was actually there on that roster. He was, an, he was on the intact, inactive list, but I think he played a couple of games. Uh, Aaron Afalo there. Sharp shooter himself. Celtics didn't make it, a uh, young Celtics team. Uh, at least Jalen Brown's progressing. I guess that's good for the Celtics. Uh, Jason Tatum's coming back, um, coming up in this draft class, so they might pick him up if they get the third pick. Um, I don't know if they traded. I, I'm pretty sure I didn't trade their pick. Uh, Bucks didn't make it. Um, they should be really happy about the uh, uh, performance of... Where, where is he? Brogdon. Where's Bogey? Yeah, there is Bogey. Um, 78 overall, you progressed really well. Giannis a 91, Chris Middleton an 82. Their worries right now is to sign Giannis at this point. He's, a, <laughs> he's their main priority. This team stinks without them. If he if he doesn't sign, um, if he doesn't sign back, uh, they better sign some good bench depth, to say the least. Um, this Sixers team, uh, pretty stinky to say the least. Gerald Henderson was their shooting guard and Bayless was there. Point guard, as you can see here, this is a Bayless that um, uh, played um, on the Sixers team. 
this is not actually Bayless himself, his 2K form, or like his actual player form. This is a made-up J- Bayless. You can see that is a spot-on Bayless right there. You can see that actually looks like Bayless. Whoever made these rosters, I'll try finding him out. I didn't take a picture of it, unfortunately. Uh, I'll try searching him up uh, on uh, the NBA 2K Finder. I'll put it down in the comments. Uh, this That Nets team sucks. You guys already saw it. Uh, Tim Rolls, Spurs, Jazz, yeah, you know the whole gist. Um, let's get started with the simulation. Uh, so we'll simulate one game. Oh, and the Bulls take one game. Oh my goodness. This D Wade Butler team, Jimmy Butler went off, shot terribly. Uh, everyone shot terribly except for Doug McDermott, Doug McBuckets, his nickname. Uh, I remember him on the Thunder. Uh, a plus three point shot. What's a three point shot? 91, pretty well, to say the least. Bobby Portis, Todd Gibson, Rajon Rondo, um, Denzel Valentine, Isaiah Cannon, yeah. I don't know how this team beat the Raptors. Let's see the Raptors, how they did. DeMar DeRozan played pretty well. Where did Lowry go? Oh my god. Lowry played god awful. Look at this. Look at this shit. One for ten. One for eight. Holy crap. That is bad. Kevin Durant did pretty well. Kyle Lowry played terrible. Okay, Siakam got some minutes. That's good. Jakob Pertl didn't play, Powell didn't play, Solinger didn't play. But other than that, this is a pretty good team to play off with. Oh my goodness, that's a tough loss. 2-0! There's no way! Jimmy Butler, D. Wade, great performances. Rondo, Lopez, not that great. The bench didn't play that good. Let's see the Raptors again. DeRozan did pretty good this time. Shot his free throws pretty well. The Bulls blowed them out as well. James Johnson. Lowry. Lowry's been the issue. He's not stepping up. Wow. Kyle Lowry choking. Valentin is also choking. He's not doing enough. He's not producing enough. Lowry not passing the ball enough. What is going on? Oh, he did get 11 assists. What am I saying? This is insane. What the hell? Three. Oh, they're about to sweep in this bit. Oh my god! Kevin Durant, a good performance! DeRozan, Valanciunas, Lowry! Oh my goodness, what a, bef- what a performance from the Bulls! Jimmy Butler stepping up! Oh my god, the Raptors definitely need a change in free agency! Holy shit! This is a pretty, pretty darn well performance from this Bulls team! Like, they're not shooting well. D. Wade made the threes he needed to make. Rajon Rondo made the assist. He's not playing well, but Jimmy Butler is playing really well. It's just, I think the issue is, oh, who is this Mirtich? Dar- Nikola Mirtich is playing really good in this playoffs. Let me check his playoff stats right now. 15 points per game. He's really stepped it up. Nikola Mirtich, very, very good performance. By Meritage, I think this is why the Bulls bench is playing much better than the Raptors bench. Um, their star players are playing pretty well, except for Rondo. A lot of, like their bench is stepping up a lot, and it's really um, doing them bits. And the Raptors got swept. Oh my God! Upset alert. The Timber- Timberwolves are gonna sweep the uh, the Clippers. Pretty expected there. Uh, this Warriors team with Iguodala, this is still a solid team without Kevin Durant. According to a lot of people saying, all those haters saying that Kevin Durant was nothing towards this team. I guess 2K is kind of showing you that, you know, this team, you know, in the future aren't going to be that great. You know what I'm saying? Curry and Clay can only do so much. Um, you're going to check the box score for this series. Uh, Steph Curry, Clay Thompson, they did their stuff. Um... Uh, Kevin Martin, I'm pretty sure he was a filler, but he's playing really good. Uh, <laughs> that's pretty funny to say. I think he was on that team. I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure he wasn't. Uh, you could check down in the link down below. Uh, I'll make sure to post that link to where I got my information from. Um, yeah, this is pretty, pretty, pretty bad from the Warriors standpoint. Rockets, James Harden. Holy shit, this simulation is getting intense. James Harden with 64 points. I think he probably made the history books. Averaging 30, 41 points per game. I need to be a bit quiet because it's 12 o'clock right now. Holy shit. This is insane performances all around. Wow. Pretty insane performances whatsoever. Holy shit. 
Okay, there's a pretty tight series there. I'm gonna simulate um, a couple of more games. Three one, three one, two two, three one, two two. A sweep there from this magic. Um, I'm not gonna go into that a bit more. Uh, these two more because it's 50 minutes. This has been going through. Um, wow, that's surprising to say the least. James Harden going off. Uh, I'm going to simulate playoffs because I don't want to waste too much time. Uh, Cavs win the championship. LeBron wins finals MVP. The Timberwolves playing out of their minds. Made the finals. I'm so proud of this team. <laughs> Did not expect him to play this good. I think Cat was the difference maker or Zach Levine. Um... I, I feel like if they did keep Zach Levine, they'd be an actual menace um, to the NBA. Um, unfortunately, they traded for Jimmy Butler, who had only one season. That's unfortunate. Um, you know, Cat and Jimmy Butler had beef. Um, I still like Jimmy Butler as a player, but, you know, Cat's my favorite player. I need to back him up. Um, Cavs here. Let's see LeBron's performances. Kyrie Irving stepping up. He did step up in this playoffs. So this is a pretty accurate simulation, to say the least. Um... Pretty, pretty good all around. Uh, that's pretty much for this video. Um, James Harden. I need to check. Uh, hold on. Let me check. Can I not check team history? This is insane, man. James Harden. Holy. Let me check Thor uh, Harden's stats. 64 points he dropped. 36 points per game and all that to lose to lose in the second round to the Timberwolves man that Timberwolves team is gonna be a scary team wow that that is incredible